Hi everyone, this is Deepthi Stephens and welcome back to another video. Today's video is going to be a simple one. In this video, I'll show you how I watercolored the cover page of my art journal book. I recently made this book with heavyweight cardstock. The cardstock weighs around 300 gsm, I guess. I combined and adhere both the pages so that uh, so that would be around 600 gsm which can withhold water very well and there is no chance of smearing the paper. I also distress the edges of the pages for more handmade look. Do let me know in the comments if you are interested in the making of this book. I shall make a video on it. Now let's move on to the cover page. I wanted the girl on the cover page to be like me. It's obvious the book is mine so the image must look like me. I have a little chubby oval face and dusky in color and I have a long black hair. Not so long, a little below my waist. I also wear specs but you know what, I really don't like wearing them so specs was missing in the image. I started by masking the edges of the page with washi tape and drew the image and then applied a water wash with a large paint brush. Here the watercolors I am using are the newly released liquid watercolors by Craftangles. These colors are vibrant and highly pigmented and with a single drop you can achieve different shades of colors. They blend in very well and once they are dry, the pigment never fades away. It stays bright and strong. You can easily lift up the color from the paper and it has all the properties of watercolors. Craftangles released rainbow colors but I wanted brown for the skin tone so I mixed purple and yellow to get that brown color. You can also mix red and or uh, you can also mix red and green, blue and orange to achieve brown pigment. Since I already have uh, purple on the palette I mixed with yellow.
original layout was very simple and easy to make. I added the scripture, He shall give thee the desires of thine heart. Yes, so much positivity and energy. I'll automatically get uh, boosted up by seeing this book. So, I hope you enjoyed watching me watercolor. If you like this video anytime, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching. Take care and I'll see you next time.